off speed? Um, it takes a while. But I'll catch you. Are you sure about that? I mean, have you even flown in that thing before? Not exactly. But I assure you it's more advanced in every way. Oh, well, if you say it's more advanced, then by all means, I guess I'll just surrender right to Tank you. missile! Careful, man. There's a brand new suit here. So you just killed him? Yeah, I mean, it was either that or have Pepper do it for me. So I just decided to take all the credit. That's sort of arrogant and thoughtful. But still, you just killed him off. That's pretty dark. I mean, you knew the guy almost your whole life. He tried to kill me twice. And haven't you learned yet that if you put your supervillain in prison, they just vow revenge and break out again? Yeah, that, that never happens. So after you killed him, what happened? Well, after that, I uh, had a press conference and told the world I'm Iron Man. What? what? Dude, you can't give away your secret identity. Why not? Because I did, and I'm awesome. So, in your face. You just can't. I mean, you're not supposed to. Eh, I like the attention. You mean to tell me you've never revealed your secret identity before? Um, no. Ha! Try every girl you've ever dated. What? Oh, I'm Bruce Wayne, and I like you. Let me tell you my big secret. Oh, you're one to talk, Mr. Mind Eraser. Oh, don't even. I will freeze breath your face off. No, you won't. You're right, I won't. I love this guy. Up top. But you know I could have high-fived you into the ground just now, right? Guys, guys, it's not a contest. Because I think we all know who would win if it were. Me. Oh, oh whatever. I'm Batman. Let's arm wrestle right now. I must go back to Asgard, but I give you my word. I will return for you. Deal. Deal. Whoa. So, we must go. Yeah, yeah, I know. I just, um... I think I may not want to leave now. What? what? Well, I've got my hammer back, I've got a hot girlfriend. Things are really looking fairly well for me. But the... What about... Oh yeah, I'm gonna stay. Good luck to you, old friends. So you just abandoned everything? Of course. Wouldn't you? No. Yes. Dude. What can I say? Chicks are my kryptonite. Yeah, I'd probably leave it all behind too. Yep. But still, what about your brother? I mean, won't he destroy that ice realm? Meh. If he does, I'm sure my father will take care of it when he wakes. I've done it, father. I destroyed all of Jodenheim while you were sleeping. And that is why you are also banished. What? I take from you your power. And I cast you out. Son of a... Ice giant. Your dad is sort of extreme. Well, I suppose he's a little strict, but everything he does, he does for a reason. Like stealing a baby? And then raising that baby as your brother? And making him believe he could be king? So that he goes crazy with jealousy and becomes your lifelong enemy? Yeah. Way to go, Dad. Yes, well, that may be true. But at least I have a father. Oh, burn! So are we just gonna do this every time a superhero comes along? Probably. Feels like we always do. Not always. Oh, Sam. <laughs> ah, he'll be fine. He just gets really moody. Mrs. Stark. Whoop, whoop, whoop! You see nothing. He's uh not ready yet. Just a uh, few more seconds, and ah, oh, there we go. Superhero steroids. Force it down now, a lot of people are gonna die. I gotta put her in the water. Please, don't do this. We, we have time. We can work it out. Just turn the plane around. I wish I could, but there's just no time. It's just on the cards, you know? What do you mean? Do you not have control of the plane? No, I've got control. Are the bombs set to explode on a timer? Can you not disarm them? I actually got rid of most of them already. They're not even bombs, really. More like these tiny little airplanes with ejector seats and everything. I even flew one. Then why can't you pilot one of the bombs back here before the plane crashes? That sure sounds nice. 
is just too late. You turn that plane around right now. Can't do it. You are being absurd. I'm going to need a rain check on that dance, Peggy. You're not even going to look for a parachute. Something. Just right into the ground. I really wanted to take you dancing. I'm really starting to doubt your interest in this relationship. Oh, I'm so alone up here with no option of survival. And it's so heartbreaking. The plane's going down. You know what? Fine. Crash your stupid plane. Freeze to death if that's what you want. See if I care. It's so sad. I don't want to freeze to death. Thanks for the muscles, but it's too late now. Ah! When Captain America throws his mighty shield, all those who choose to oppose his shield must yield. Unless you're a plane or a bomb or some ice, then he'll choose to take a nap because the ice seems nice. When Captain America throws his mighty shield! Haha, <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys. You're hilarious. Hey, I'm Captain America. I can sock old Hitler on the jaw. Yeah, just make sure someone else pilots the plane to get me there, right? <laughs> <laughs> you remember Hitler, right? That other guy you were fighting before you froze yourself. <laughs> hey. I had no choice, okay? <laughs> Don't crash the plane in warmer waters. I only swim when I'm chasing submarines. <laughs> oh, like you two could have done it any better. Are you kidding? Dude, I catch falling planes in midair like every other week. And I'm Batman. Okay, okay, fair enough. But wait. <gasps> Shh. Do you guys hear that? Hear what? Is that the Justice League calling? I don't hear anything. Yeah, me either. Exactly. Oh, and oh. Captain America burn. Easy there, <laughs> Okay, when he gets here, I'll do my hands like this, and you do your hands the same. And on the count of dry, catch him with a fence of fire. Or we could just burn him. Isn't that the purpose of having flamethrower arms? Oh, Ow! Fence of fire! Fence of fire! Oh. <laughs> Take that, Hydra Nazis! Are we done here? Hello. You're still here? Yes. Why didn't you run away while we settled our differences? I'll never tell. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're not taking him back to base. He is definitely up to something. ever had shawarma this place serves food yeah you never had shawarma either shawarma. Um, why do i have to sit on hulk's lap mm. another hey i'm batman you want to know my secret identity why <clears throat> so you guys had quite a weekend <laughs> That's an understatement. First you guys were all against each other, then your buddy got killed, so you're suddenly friends. Someone died? Uh, yeah, um, you kind of missed out on that part. But luckily you still wanted to be friends later. Oh. Yeah, right after you fell from the sky and conveniently learned to control your rage. And did you steal a motorcycle? Um, details not important. Details like Odin being able to send Thor back to Earth? What? Or the professor conveniently making a way to close the portal? That worked out well for you guys. Or the Chitari all dying Phantom Menace style after the nuke? Yep. One convenient thing after another. Hmm. Kind of like your utility bill. Oh. Oh, you know what I think? I think you two are just jealous that we knocked it out of the park. <laughs> totally. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. Slam. Dodgers, boss. Sorry, guys. I'm not jealous. I'm Batman. I guess I would be jealous if I wasn't like all of you combined. 
If I couldn't fly or shoot lasers or catch missiles or see really far, or smash through buildings or wear red and blue. What's that? You're fading out. Oh, we, we broke it too many records. We can't hear you through all of this box office money. Sharma. <laughs> <laughs> Natasha, do I have a mark on my face? It really hurts. Right here. Not here, or here so much, but right here. Nope, ship shape. Hey guys, time to suit up. Oh my gosh, what happened to your face? I knew it. Okay Jarvis, I just gave my home address to an international terrorist and challenged him to a fight. I want you to cancel all detective work rendering projects and focus all of our resources on defending my house from attack, all right? Very well, sir. Shall I engage in a house party protocol now, then? Sure, why not? <laughs> so who's bullying you? How do you know I get picked on at school? Because you hang out with middle-aged guys in garages? Oh. Here, kid. I have a weaponized flare to use on a bully or whatever. Is this legal? <gasps> You're freaking me out! <laughs> you realize this is the exact premise of the Pixar film Incredibles. What? No. Yes. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. I met you a long time ago, hurt your feelings, which pushed you over the edge, and now you're a supervillain, currently with the upper hand, and I'm temporarily trapped. It's totally the same story. This is not, f first of all, I'm surprised Tony Stark even knows that movie well enough to reference its storyline. And secondly, what do you mean temporarily trapped? Your hands are totally permanently secured in those zip ties. You're not going anywhere. You are Syndrome, and I am Mr. Incredible. This is not the same. I can breathe fire. I even have a black friend who helps me fight crime. And he has a super suit. Oh my gosh, this is totally the Incredibles. You know what bugs me? What? When the president is being held hostage in the Iron Patriot suit, the suit is completely useless. But when Rhodey puts it on, it suddenly works completely fine. That's what bothers you? Yeah, that bugs me. Well, you know what bugs me? How you got all the way back to Gotham City after climbing out of that prison on the other side of the planet. Why don't you explain that? Why do so many people have a problem with this? I said... It's because I'm Batman. Can we get back to the story, please? Fine, continue. Hey, how come your bra didn't burn in the fire? What? Tony! The world's in danger! It's time to assemble! We need you! Roar, Avengers! Need Tony! Need suit! Oh, you guys are still around. I'm sorry, everyone. I just blew up all my suits. I'm kind of a changed man now. Why would you blow up all your suits? See, it was sort of metaphorical, showing Pepper that she's more important than any mission, and, and I'm more than just a suit. Plus, it's Christmas. Huzzah! I heard your call, my brothers and sister. Let us go forth to victory! Tony just blew up all of his suits. Sayeth, what? Why would Snell do this? Yeah, Stark is out. He's... he's totally whipped. But I might have an alternate. Pepper! You're basically like Terminator 2 now. You want to take Tony's place on this one? Me? Yeah, girl. You want to go save the world? Really? That actually sounds exciting. She can't replace me. What just happened here? She killed the Mandarin. With my tech? Guys, I blew up all my suits, but that doesn't mean I'm not still Iron Man. So you want to go with us? Okay. Oh, thanks a lot, guys. Come on. Pepper. I love you, sweetheart. She can't replace me. I am Iron Man. You hear me? I am Iron Man. So are you retired now, or what? I don't know. Are you retired now? Well, I know I'm not retired. I'm just getting started. Here, hang on to these for me, will you? What the? Gross. I'll be right back. Reboot! I am Iron Man. I'm Batman. So get your Mandarin's Margarine today. You'll never see this sweet, buttery imitation coming. I know, it's totally disappointing. I'm Dawn, my friend. How is my lady of Earth? How doth she? She fares really well. Mm -hmm. Good. She bathes as we speak. That is good. 
Well, wait, she's what? I can see everything, man, and it is amazing. Stop creeping on my lady friend, dude! Swift and unexpected ending. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, let's leave his body here and get back to the situation at hand. Are you sure he's dead? He did just make it look like your hand was cut off. And he is evil. He is dead, my love. See? Yeah, I'm not buying it. Here. Oh! <laughs> really? Okay, you caught me, all right? I'm not dead. Jeez! Right in the berries. So they completely ruined my plan. Ah, uh, oh, no. Heroes way. are so annoying. I know, right? Especially when they happen to be your perfect brother. So then what'd you do? I had to help Thor fight that stupid elf and then return to my cell in Asgard. Oh, that's terrible. I know. I really thought I had it all in the bag, too. I was going to fool everyone, take Odin's throne as my own. Everyone would have been like, Say it, what? Where's Odin? That's so evil. I always liked Odin. <sighs> you would. So how did you escape? Magic, duh. I love magic tricks. You want to see this pencil disappear? Hey, Loki. Thanks for hogging my spotlight, you jerk. Hey, why don't you try to steal some magic gas that no one cares about, Maliki? Oh. <laughs> I'm totes going to control the darkness and rule the universe. You were foiled by two human scientists and two brainless interns carrying nothing but tripods. So? So good day. <laughs> Amateur. Noob thinks because he has an army, he's automatically the next big thing. Well, Loki did kind of pull focus. Well, wouldn't you? Absolutely. You want to know what I would have done? I would have said, you want to know how I got these scars? And, and then I'd blow something up. I don't know. I kind of like to keep people guessing. <sighs> this sucks. Who knows how long it will take me to have Odin's throne now? <laughs> you know what's funny? If you had just been a good child, Odin probably would have just handed you the throne. You know, since Thor doesn't want it. Yes, <laughs> thank you for that reminder, General. You know what else is funny? What's that? If you had just colonized Mars, you could have saved your entire race. <laughs> You're blowing my mind, Loke. Hmm. You guys stood me up, didn't you? <laughs> for the shield. <gasps> I'm keeping this. Give it! Here's the plan. You two will definitely infiltrate the glass fishbowl on the bottom of the heavily armored carriers. Then, sneakily insert these delicate little computer chips into exactly the right slot in a huge rack of other tiny, delicate little computer chips. Got it? I'm confused. If the point is to destroy the carriers, why are we going through all this trouble? Shouldn't we just call the Hulk or something? Yeah, didn't he, like, rip one to pieces already? No. We make this work with just us. We're all we've got. I'm okay with calling the Hulk up. Really? Yeah, maybe get Iron Man up here with a tank missile or something? It's just us. It's really no trouble. He already texted back. On Hulk way, looking for motorcycles. I said we aren't calling in the Avengers! Fine! Hulk, <laughs> Well, this plan sounds extremely dangerous. What else can we do? Uh, I have this cool disguise o mesh technology that completely changes my appearance. Will that help? You help? What? You've had that this whole time? Yeah. Why? We've been hiding for our lives, woman. Okay. New plan. And I, and I would have gotten away with it, too, if it weren't for you sneaky kids and your disguise o mesh. <laughs> uh, uh, this is Director Pierce. Uh, we are aborting the launch. Uh, please stop all protocols and start dismantling the helicarriers. And if you're Hydra, uh, report to room 41 and don't bring your weapons. Thanks. Hail Hydra. So you saved the day. <laughs> yeah, we did. Yeah, none of us were really worried for you. Excuse me? Fury almost died. Yeah, and then he didn't. 
I'm sensing a pattern here. Colton, Stark, Loki, you thought they were gone, and then they weren't. You should be careful with that. Be careful coming back to life? What does that even mean? Didn't you fake your own death? Well, sure, but I can get away with that sort of thing. Do not ask him why. Because I'm bad, man. <sighs> he has a point, though. You keep dying and bringing people back to life, nobody will accept it if one of you actually gets killed someday. <laughs> None of us are gonna die. That's silly talk. Okay, well, we'll see. So what's next? Just cleaning up the rest of Hydra. Falcon offered to take care of it. Hail Hydra. Hail Hydra. Sir! I got you, sucker! <laughs> Me? I'm just gonna take it easy for a while. Go on some dates? What is your deal with my love life? No, I'm gonna go find my friend Bucky and convince him he's not evil so we can be Toad's besties. Uh, Toad's besties? Yeah. Stark told me that's so you refer to best friends now. Yeah, cross that off your list. Speaking of Bucky, I have a question for you, Cap. Shoot. Remember that one time on the roof when Captain America threw his mighty shield? <sighs> really? You're bringing up my old theme song again? Yes, I've heard that. All those who choose to oppose his shield must yield. Well, did the Winter Soldier yield when you threw your mighty shield? No. What did he do? He caught it with his super arm. So, unless you're a plane... Or a bomb. Or some ice. Or a brainwashed buddy with a robotic arm. It doesn't even rhyme. Then, then you, you don't, don't necessarily, necessarily have to yield. <laughs> <laughs> You guys are weird. Well, this has been great. If you'll excuse me, I need to start looking for Bucky. Let me go! Hey, kid. Sorry your uncle turned out to be a terrorist. But a birthday promise is a birthday promise. Who are you? I'm Iron Man. You're not Iron Man. Am too. Are not. Am too. Then where's your suit? Jarvis, I'm leaving. You have to mingle, sir. Then I'm having some cake. Cake missile! I know we've all lost stuff. And you think life <laughs> takes more than it gives. But not today. Today is giving us something. It's giving us a chance. To do what? To give a crap. Very well. Huh? Wait. What are you doing, man? You said to give a crap! No, 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 no! no. I mean, all you do is sit in that chair all day long. Is not having the orb going to change anything about your daily routine? I will rule the universe and sit in this chair. So bring me the orb, boy. Why don't you get up out of that chair and make me? I can't get out of this chair. It's not my time. Plus, my legs are asleep. You're so weird, that Infinity War. <laughs> <laughs> We have to get out of here. I hope you have a plan. I have a plan. Do not shoot those windows one at a time. All of you fire at the same window on my command. Ready? Oh, man. Fire! How would you like to get paid? How do you think, man? Units. Very well. Rita, don't. I will no longer be your slave. Oh, dude. Sorry, that girl looked like she was about to get in between me and becoming stupid rich. <laughs> That'll be four billion units, please. Dude, let go! No way! What are we 
do now? I don't know! So what do you want to do? Something good? Something bad? A little bit of both? We'll follow your lead, Star-Lord. A little bit of both. Wait, so who's the good and who's the bad? Hey, I'm Batman. You want to know my secret identity? Do you want a fist to the face? Never mind. He's the bad. Me. If anything, I'm the good, and you're the bad. Or we're the good, and they're the bad. Or you're the bad, and we're the good, and blah, blah, blah. This conversation bores my brain. So, welcome back to Earth, I suppose. This is awesome. There's so many things I missed out on. I got this new thing called iPod. There's like a bazillion songs on it. You guys sing a lot about butts now. Why do you do that? I don't know. Music got weird. So anyways, you guys saved the galaxy. A lot of pilots died, but hey, you all held hands at the end and sort of made it all better. Yeah, no kidding. You also left an infinity stone in a city that barely has any protection left. Did you see where I got the stone the first time? There was like nobody guarding it. You guys and your infinity stones. So you're like half human and half something else. Are, are you not the least bit interested in knowing who your own dad is? What? Sorry, I didn't hear you. Did you know they made Transformers movies? They look so weird. He asked who your father is. They made Ninja Turtles into a movie, too. Several times. I feel like he's conveniently dodging this topic. You, one who is part bat and part man, who is your father? Oh, I'm not part bat. I just dress like a bat. Because I'm Why bad. do you dress like a bat? To strike fear in the hearts of my enemies. Duh. Bats are not scary. Bats are tiny mammals. Bats are totally scary. You should be called Normal Man. Dresses as Bat. I'm not just a normal man. I'm Batman. I am Groot. 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 I'm Batman. This could I go on for a while. I'm Batman. I am Groot. 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 I'm Batman. Getting the hiccups. G.I. Joe got a movie too. Man, the future is awesome! I need to see these movies right now! Ah, oh. Well, now I know. And knowing is half the battle. I am Groot! Pinocchio sounds scary. Even I get that reference. Okay, how about this? A dream is a wish your heart makes. Oh, oh, it's more Disney films. Don't do that. I can show you the world. Oh, no, no, no. That's even worse. Shining, shimmering, splendid. You are ruining my childhood. Someone make it him stop. Akuna Matata. Children. Do you want to build a snowman? Ah! Snowman, it's a summer! I had strings, but now I don't. All our work is gone. Ultron deleted everything, and now he's in the internet. If he's in the internet, he can do anything. Hey, guys, I can't check my emails. He changed all our passwords. He gets worse. Ultron shut off the cable. This is all your fault. How are we supposed to watch Game of Thrones now, Tony? Oh, we got no cable. We got no internet. Rage! Okay, let's see how fast I can buy the parts for a new Veronica. Oh, that's evil. He's using our technology against us. All the traffic lights are green. 
I can handle this. War Machine, coming at you. Don't worry, I got it. Oh, your suits don't work either. This is bad. This is very, very bad. Stop! What did you do? What did you do? We have to save these people! Everyone, get in the Quinjet! I hope you don't mean this Quinjet. Oh, come on! Oh, no. oh, I just sent them on endless goose chases while I evolved and made my Earth-destroying meteor. <laughs> they never even stood a chance. <laughs> So when is this medium supposed to hit? Oh, sometime about now. <laughs> <laughs> said no. Wait, what? Hey, did you hear something? How in the world? Never mind. We'll talk later. Hey, do you mind if I study the scepter for a few days? Of course. I do not see any harm in leaving it in your hands rather than just taking it straight to Asgard right now. Do not let him study that scepter! Thor, you promised me danger. So far all that's happened is you've undressed and gotten into this cave pool. You can't help but feel like something's missing. I'm having a vision! <laughs> All right, I'm out. We have to do something. Does anyone know how to stop a runaway train? I got it! Just your friendly neighborhood Marvel Universe Spider-Man! Is that the best you can do? This is the best I can do. It's just what I want. All of you. children. What? That we are called mutants. Stopping. I thought you were stopping. Yeah, are we not stopping? Of course not. Oh, okay. Son of a And then the strongest Ultron was dead, so we finished saving the world again. <laughs> yeah, oh. we did. <laughs> <laughs> the age of Ultron is over. I wouldn't call that an age. Yeah, that was more like a week at best. More like the minor setback of Ultron. Hey. That's how we roll. Can you imagine if you let Big Ultron get away for just a little bit longer? What else might have died? You can't have that. Well, congratulations this time. You stopped an evil robot by creating a superhero that is pure and good, and shoots lasers, and is red, yellow, and blue, and flies. <clears throat> Sounds familiar. Do you want to ask me if I bleed? No. But this guy's going to. He's trying to pick a fight with me. It's not going to work. Oh, yes, it will. You are gonna bleed. You mean just like your parents? Oh, you're getting mad, bro. Now, now, nobody wants a civil war. <laughs> right? Oh, no, no way, man. Kidding? We're all friends. I, just got I think that sounds kind of cool. Really? Girl, your accent is so bad. You make me want to be good. Oh, wait. I already am. Because I'm afraid of bats! Bats everywhere! Get them away from me! It's so terrifying! Yes, you will. Because a 
you want to work here, you shall do my bidding. Now plunge with all of your hatred. <laughs> <laughs>